What happened? Well, you know, a little of this, a little of that. Got myself a date tomorrow night. <gasps> See, didn't I tell you? You're getting over Ross already. Well. Get out. <laughs> never any real coffee in the mugs that the background actors would handle. However, the principals always had real coffee drinks, but I never made them. Bottle lands on Gunther, so I would have to kiss Gunther. Bye. Yeah, I guess I just had like the right weird hair and uh, and just kind of fit in the, in the coffee house, so. Uh, kind of like the, the guy behind the counter, and they eventually kind of expanded upon that. So basically, this is a getting rid of anything Rachel ever touched sale. Touched, used, sat on, slept on. I'll take it all. <laughs> I think uh, Gunther hopefully is over Rachel by now. Buddy. <laughs> you know, I want a man. happily married to someone and has two children with hair brighter than the sun. I finished it! I did it all by myself! And there's nobody to hug! <laughs> Guys, be up to a reboot and play out those characters. Well, of course. Why not? <laughs> yeah, maybe the Janice and Gunther show, right? right? right. <laughs> there you go. Please welcome James Michael oh, Tyler. It was the most memorable uh, 10 years of my life. Honestly, I, I could not have imagined uh, just a better experience. Uh, all these guys were fantastic. It was just a joy to work with them. I was first diagnosed with prostate cancer in September of 2018. If there's one piece of advice that I could give men out there to avoid where I am today specifically, um, is get tested. Ask for a PSA test. My specific cancer went to the bones. Yeah, if you want to stick around, uh, get tested. I dropped a cup. <laughs>